just as a strangler fig uh, attached itself to the tree that it strangled, now we see something happening to the strangler fig that's very similar. Right here we have a, a philodendron, which is starting actually down at the bottom. It will grow up, it's growing straight up, attached to the, to the, to the trunk here, trying to get its way up to get some light also. That's its main, main uh, uh, reason for climbing. What happens is the seed lands down there after a bird defecates, and there's a thing called scototropism with uh, philodendrons, and they, they, they grow to the darkest location, and then once they hit the, 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 the base of a tree, which is the darkest location, then they, start cha they change and they start climbing up. So here, this guy is attached to the, to the strangler fig, just like the strangler fig was attached to the other one. Now it's growing up and growing up, and once it hits a place where there's much more light, the leaf goes through a metamorphosis, basically, and changes into something that looks completely different. So those big leaves up there are actually the same plant as these small leaves down below. It's the same exact philodendron, but now it's actually acquiring light and can do a lot more photosynthesis. So this is just another intricacy that there's so much connection, like I say, in the rainforest. And that's what we're experiencing here, is everything is so connected and dependent on each other that without, without certain things, this whole thing, would, this whole rainforest wouldn't survive. It's a very, very fragile type of environment when it really comes down to it. Most people are unaware of it, but the cattle industry actually causes more global warming and climate change than all the planes, trains, cars, trucks, and ships on this planet. Because we don't think about it, but it's cutting down the rainforest, burning them, all the transportation involved, raising these cattle. So they cause actually more global climate change than all the vehicles and transportation on the planet. 